Yeah, we got a package that arrived the other day, yesterday, but um, I want to talk about this a little bit first before we, we open this. First of all, it was just left on my front porch, down for sound logos all over this. I mean, you pay attention, you got the, the porch pirate thing going on where people are coming up and snatching stuff off people's porches and plain boxes. I don't know about you, but I don't, I'm not all that too cool with the advertising that's all over it. That's just asking for it. Not to mention, this is how it showed up. Look how beat up this is. Box is ripped open. Like I can almost see inside of there. Big hole right there. If this was an amplifier, it would probably been it would probably been crushed, or at least the end of it would have been destroyed. Look at that holes. I know what it is already because I ordered it, but still, that's that's FedEx is doing, and that's three now um, that have showed up like this. The FedEx is becoming a joke because there's this. There's the other level six that showed up that was the wrong sub and was dropped in shipping and shipped to the magnet and we're not getting into that, but that was garbage. And we just ordered a new bedroom set for my daughter. FedEx drops off her dresser the other day. The whole top of the dresser's got the corner busted off. And like FedEx is becoming a joke. But that's, that's my thoughts. Not too keen on the packaging because it's hard enough to... Anybody that knows what Down for Sound is, no chances are whatever's sitting on your front porch isn't going to be cheap. <clears throat> or at least some garbage that, oh, you know, it's going to be something worth some money to all the crackheads that are going around and stealing stuff off of people's porches. Anyway, we got a steak knife. Cut this open and try to do it one handed. Let's see how much of this I gotta pull off. Yeah, I wasn't a. Uh, wasn't too happy seeing this on the front porch. I'm not too worried about it because of what's inside of it, but if it was anything else, an amp, a sub, some components, even like door speakers or something. If I ordered some mids or highs. And it looks to me like that tape, look at this. It looks like this box was already just split in half. Split in half. All the way. And they just slapped that tape on there. See that? Look at that. What a freaking joke. Not impressed at all. Let me see if this just rips in half. And I, uh... Oh, the bottom of it's still connected. Okay. But yeah, sides are completely gone. I think I'm gonna I'm gonna try getting whatever else I get shipped UPS if I can because UPS is still actually like careful with the stuff. I got a buddy that's UPS. I was talking to him about all this. He said, yeah, he's not delivering my route yet, but soon enough. We'll just slide all this out. Look at that. Finally. I'm quite sure what that is. That's probably some stickers or something. There we go. Some 50 foot. Certified base had 2 watt. I 
waiting on this stuff for like eight months. It's ridiculous. 50 foot of clear, 50 foot of black. 5,929 strands. Same with the clear. Clear is hard to see, but. Let's see what this is. This is probably some, some stickers or something. Invoice. Yeah, I gotta. I mean, I gotta give it to JP. He gives you some freebies and stuff. Oh, there's a dumb dumb in there. In that little envelope. <clears throat> but yeah, not not cool with that packaging. <coughs> Lanyard. Hell, I got I don't know how many of them things laying around. Oh, that's cool. You got me a actual receipt, printed invoice. That's cool. I ain't going to show you that. That got the address and everything on it. That's a new one because none of the other stuff I got. A little business card. You know, you got that dumb dumb. And a certified base head sticker. That'll probably go on a new toolbox. I ain't loading a truck with stickers like I did with a Jeep. I'm going to go a little more stealthy. Couple. There's a couple on there. Just stockpiling. 25 feet of clear. 25 feet of black. I probably got already 100 feet in there between the two power runs at the back and the big three and the one single ground all the way to the front. And then I did not have enough to do the triple imp or the dual inputs. So that's mainly what this is for. Plus, hey, I want to have extra. I don't want to wait eight months to get it again. When it runs out, I might end up doing another uh, run to the front, to the back. Maybe two more. I'll see how everything plays. It's going to be a while before it's up and playing because I'm just stockpiling stuff right now. Like you can see, I still got the GP Deadner. I didn't even put that in. It's freaking cold. It's cold still. Amper 9K. Sleeping under that nice cozy blankie. The wire for the mids. And you can put that in. So this is just going to go in the pile that's building up over here. Until I'm ready. I believe the next thing coming is going to be the subs. Because <clears throat> I, uh, I signed a job bid at work if I get this job bid it's an extra three dollars an hour right off the rip plus I get a or um, cost of living raise or whatever actually kicks in today on the first for our contract and next month I get a 50 cent raise so fingers crossed on nobody in the next week if I got this job or at least this temp job will work. And that'll be like an extra four to, extra 160 a week. And I'll just stash that money. But I think the subs are going to be next. If I can decide. I'm still up in the air between uh, some FI teams. 18s or the new SP4 Plus 18s. I'm I'm curious to know what just adding that one extra magnet, that one extra slug does for that motor. I mean, I know the SP4s are beasts, but I mean, I want it to still be musical at the same time, too. But I also want to have a good bandwidth. So, all right. There's today's little, uh, uh, little update. Check that watch out. Ain't that cool? That was my, uh, Valentine's Day present from the old lady and the kid. Cool as hell, man. You can see the stupid camera won't focus. 
You can see all them guts all the way. There it is. You can see all them guts all the way through. I'm a fan of them gut shots. So that's awesome. See that little gear moving? Look at it go. Anyhow. Alright, y'all. Thanks for watching. Peace.